guys, I just got back from Target and I thought that I would sit down with you guys really quick and share with you a few of the things that I picked up while I was at Target. Um, I'm about ready to start a month of purging and home organization, which is going to start in the month of May. And, but first, let's go ahead and get started with some of the stuff that I picked up at Target. Okay, so first things first, I picked up two of these totes. Um, I... I have an idea in my head what I want to use for these totes. I actually want to start putting some of my shoes in here. Um, I do have a bunch of little tiny uh, like shoe totes that I have that I um, put some of my shoes in. But I want to see if I can actually just put a bunch of shoes inside of this tote and just stack them nicely like, you know, like this. So they're all kind of nicely stacked and then I could stack these in my closet for the organization and the purge. Okay. So I got two of those and those um, these were like six dollars. I think at Target So those are really good heavy-duty totes. Um, the other thing that I picked up at Target was some more tissue paper um, If you guys um, didn't know yet, you guys will know in a second. I actually have a posh store um, Or my posh closet over on Poshmark and you guys can go over there and follow me I'll put the information right here and a link to it I think below in the description box if I can find the link um, Anyway, you guys can find me over there in posh. I put a lot of my like um, shoes and clothing and stuff over there for people to purchase. So if you guys are ever interested in getting some of my wardrobe, you guys can go over to my posh closet and take a look. But I always like to wrap up my posh um, <clears throat> sales, whatever anybody buys, in really, really pretty uh, tissue paper. And then I put a little sticker on it and then I send it with a thank you note as well. So it just kind of makes it a little bit more personal. Um, it makes it feel like they're they're getting something nice and new, which they are, um, which is nice and fresh too that they're getting. And it just everybody likes to open up something that's really pretty. So I thought that, um, you know, tissue paper would be cute. And that's actually suggested on the Posh site as well. Um, okay, so I obviously love to walk around Target. Who doesn't? And then you spend a little bit more than you normally do. But I really didn't buy excuse me, any unnecessary items this time around. I really did stick to what I needed to get. And um, so that's what I did. I'm going to move that out of the way because it's just like bugging me right there in the corner. Okay. So I picked up two more of my baby oils. Um, these one, one is for my bathroom and then I think I'm almost out in my travel bag, but um, I always use baby oil. If you guys have been watching me now for a while, you guys know that right before I get out of the shower, I just squirt baby oil on from my neck down and it actually keeps my skin so dry. I mean, it keeps my skin, not dry. It keeps my skin um, really um, full of moisture and it just makes it really, really soft and it does not dry out my skin. That's kind of what I was trying to say. Um, I don't not, don't suffer from dry skin because I use this stuff all of the time. So I bought that and then I was out of my JJ wash. Um, I actually love having just like regular like body wash for my body but special soap for those special areas. Um, and I love Summer's Eve. I've been using this for a while. This one is a new scent though and I really did like it. It kind of smelled like berry-ish but it also smelled fresh. So I just, I'm like, you know, I love having a fresh JJ. Who doesn't? All right, so um, I picked up, these were on clearance. You guys can see the little clearance up here. This is that um, Herbal Essence uh, shampoo that I actually been talking about for quite some time. This is the coconut milk one. And before I purchased this, I actually opened it up to smell it, see if I would really like the coconut smell. And I actually did. I am not a huge coconut fan, but I do like the fact that it, it smells nice. It makes me feel like I'm um, at the beach or a tanning salon or I'm laying up on the swimming pool, but the coconut is so nice. Um, these were on sale for $5.58. This is the big, large size with the pump, which is nice because that'll be really nice in the shower. And then they also had the um, shampoo as well. So I got the shampoo and conditioner to match, which very rare that you'd find both of these, I think, you know, on clearance or something together. Um, so it must not have been like a popular scent for some people. Alrighty, so the other few things that I did get, oh, I did buy something unnecessary, but not like expensive unnecessary, but I'll show you in just a second. I'm gonna unload this bag. La 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 la, la 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 la. Alrighty, so 
Um, I picked up some more of my Cascade because I, um, I'm almost out and I just actually emptied this inside of a container underneath my sink. Um, but I knew I was almost out. That's why I have the clear containers because then I can tell when I'm about ready to run out with these. I'm like, oh, I'm out. Yay. But now I just, um, open this up, pour it inside that clear container and then I know exactly when I run out. So I was almost out. So I got some of that. Um, I got a new candle, which is the Mrs. Myers candle. Um, if you guys know for a while, I've been loving this Mrs. Myers candle and, um, I do not like the lavender, but I got the lemon verbena and this one is the best scent. I've smelled the honeysuckle, the basil, the lemon. Don't like any of those. This one, um, this is, oh, lemon, not lavender. I meant, I don't like the lavender. I like the lemon, but this is the one I love these, but these are a little expensive but they're definitely worth it because it makes my house smell so nice. All right, um, hair products again. I picked up some more blow dry quick spray. You guys know I talk about this stuff all the time. I absolutely love this stuff. I spray it in my hair every day when I'm about ready to blow dry it. And then I put this in my hair too because this is a blow dry it thermal smoother cream. This stuff is amazing too because it keeps my hair from frizzing or um, having flyaways. Um, but I love this stuff and I've been using this for quite some time and I swear by it. So I ran out of this stuff this morning. So I'm like, I had to go get some. Alrighty. So two things that I purchased, which I've never bought this brand before, I don't think. Hmm, I don't think that I have. But anyway, I love this. This is that J.R. Watkins room freshener. Um, and this was right next to the um, candles and that spray that you get. Um, but I really, I have two bottles of the Mrs. Meyer spray and I love it. I just sprayed it around my house. But this one was like, Oh my gosh, this one was amazing. I absolutely love the way this one smells a little bit better than the Mrs. Meyer spray. I don't know, I'm sorry, but I do. So I bought two of these. I got one for the house and one for my car because they smell amazing. And this one is in the Ocean Breeze. So I got the Ocean Breeze one. These were $2.99. Not too bad. Alrighty, um, this is the makeup remover, Neutrogena makeup remover wipes. I bought this, I always buy the two pack because I always keep one in here and then I take one with me to my bedroom. Um, and then I usually have some in my travel bag as well, but my travel bag is full, so. I didn't need any of my travel bag this time. But um, these Neutrogena face wipes, absolutely love them. If you guys have watched my um, empties, you guys will know that every single month I always share these because I usually use them up in a month. I think there's only 30 in here anyway. Um, but great, I love the Neutrogena face wipes. They get the makeup off with one wipe. Okay, um, this was like the unnecessary purchase, but not expensive. They were $3. This is $3. So these are really, really popular right now. And I see these a lot on Instagram. Um, I see these a lot for sale, like on Etsy or in like antique stores, but they're like so expensive in the antique stores, $3 at the dollar spot target. So I bought the really pretty like blue color one and I brought the, bought the really pretty like pink. Can you see it through the like window there? It's so pretty. Just the really pretty like pink pinky pastel color. So I got both of these for the $3 at the dollar spot. Love them. And next I bought, um, which my camera that you guys, that this is it's right there. Um, it's right there. Um, I bought two of these um, little baskets. These are gray, heavy duty baskets because I'm about ready to go into my purge mode and I'm about ready to purge my entire house. Um, starting with like bathroom, cabinets, kitchen, um, drawers, anything you possibly think of. But I bought these specifically for my bathroom cabinet um, because that's probably where I'm gonna start first is emptying all that out. But I bought these for storage because I bought two of these um, for storage so I could put stuff in there um, and store it and have it organized in a nice little caddy. I could pull it out when I need to. And then the last thing that I bought, okay, another unnecessary. Um, the last thing that I bought at Target was this cute letter box. Now, I've seen these again on um, Instagram. A lot of people keep these like in their kitchen or they keep them up in their bedroom or they set them up in their living room or they're opening the entrance of their door or whatever just to welcome friends and family and guests into their home but I saw these and I love the way that these look and I think they're a lot better 
than these ones. Like I have this one, whoops, not three days, ill, um, <laughs> Disney. Um, but I have that one. That one lights up, which is really cute too. But this one is just, I don't know. I like this one. Um, and it comes with 180 letters and characters on it. So you have a lot of letters and stuff to, to write stuff on here. And it just like slides into the little slots. This was $14.99. Absolutely love this thing. I'm so excited to use it. Um, I want to like put my countdown on here. I want to put stuff on here when I'm doing a video. So like if I did a video, this video, I'd put like Target haul on here, or whatever. So that's kind of fun. I love this thing and I love stuff like that. So, um, yeah, I'm excited to use that. But anyway, thank you guys so much for watching. I hope that you guys enjoyed this little Target haul. If you did, give it a huge thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe, and I will see you guys next time on Andy Wonderland.